New information about the day of Demi Lovato's overdose has come to light, as we've also learned she made a decision about rehab, potentially thanks to some tough love from her ex. We've got all the latest Demi updates right now. Demi Lovato is said to get out of the hospital any day now, and after days of us not knowing what she planned on doing next, she has finally made a choice. Plus, we have new details on what led to her long hospital stay. How's it going, guys? I'm Madison Hill. I know you all are going to want to hear this new Demi news, so I won't waste any more of your time. Demi has been in the hospital for over a week since her drug overdose and after suffering from several setbacks, and now more info has been released about the day Demi was found, and it kind of helps explain the severity of the situation. A new report from TMZ states that the day Demi overdosed, her bodyguard somehow had an inkling that there was an emergency at her house, and when he walked into Demi's home, he was greeted by her assistant screaming, quote, she's dead, she's dead. TMZ went on to report that the bodyguard saw noticeable signs of an overdose and potentially clogged airways, hence why she was not breathing. He reportedly was one of the key people to help until EMTs arrived. Now after that scary ordeal and several days in the hospital, as we told you yesterday, Demi is set to be released any day now. However, there was some concern on whether or not she would choose to go to rehab. Yesterday, sources told TMZ that members of Demi's team were prepared to quit if she did not make the decision to get help, and more recently, we learned that Wilmer gave her the same ultimatum. A source told Hollywood Life, quote, Wilmer wants to be there for her every step of the way, but he knows that tough love might have to make an appearance if she doesn't decide to go to rehab. The source went on to say that Wilmer wants Demi to be healthy and live a life, quote, without struggle, which is something she could not do if she chose not to get help. Luckily, though, Wilmer will not have to stop supporting Demi anytime soon, as TMZ reported it's confirmed Demi has made the decision to go to rehab. I never had any doubts that she would make this decision. I am a Levotic, after all, but I will admit all of those reports about people surrounding her giving her ultimatums did have me a little concerned. Clearly, our girl still made the right choice. Sources close to Demi revealed to TMZ that once she is released from the hospital quote any day now, she will go straight to a live-in rehab facility. TMZ did not confirm if the facility is in California or out of state, but either way, she will go directly there without any downtime in between. Obviously, Demi's family is happy that she's made the right decision to continue treatment, and it sounds like Demi is just glad to have everyone by her side. A source told Hollywood Life, quote, Demi has been apologetic to her parents and family about her relapse and overdose. She feels horrible about her situation. The source went on to say, quote, her overdose was a mistake and she did not intend to take too much of anything. Putting everyone through this amount of stress and worry was the last thing Demi reportedly wanted. Demi, know that we are all rooting for you. All right, you guys, I wanna hear all your thoughts on Demi deciding to go straight to rehab after she's released from the hospital. Do you think Wilmer had anything to do with it? Let me know in the comments below. For more on Demi, check out our full story on her team giving her an ultimatum. And for more celeb news, subscribe now.